My BFI player choice this week is a milestone of silent cinema, a sweeping epic which first dazzled audiences back in 1927 and which recently returned to our screens in all its magnificent glory thanks to a mammoth restoration process, Abel Gantz's Napoleon. As significant to the evolution of cinema as the works of Eisenstein or D.W. Griffith, Gantz's tale of the early life of Napoleon tested the possibilities of camera work, editing, narrative and projection, creating a kaleidoscopic motion picture which stretched the boundaries of the screen in every way possible. In its celebrated climactic sequence, Gantz employs the extraordinary polyvision process which effectively tripled the width of the image, a forerunner of the various widescreen processes which would become standard decades after Gantz's daring experiment. Myriad versions of Napoleon have surfaced and resurfaced over the years, but the one we're showing here on BFI Player is something extraordinary. A restoration overseen by the great Kevin Brownlow, who first saw the film in the mid-50s and who made it his mission to track down elements from various different sources to compile the most complete and definitive version possible. Along with the digital cleaning and remastering, the film benefits from a beautiful tinting process which brings the action to life in vivid, haunting hues. The superb score by Carl Davis completes the picture, as colourful, expressive and expansive as the movie itself. The BFI have described this as a project which spanned generations, a labour of love which showcases 50 years of work. Kevin Brownlow is equally effusive, labelling this a tremendous step forward for film history, to which Carl Davis adds simply, in the words of Napoleon, at last. Mm -hmm.